Hello everybody and thank you so much for watching this video. Now before I start I just want to apologize for my previous video. I know it was a complete disaster. I'm trying to help here and I'm pretty sure this will work. And I'm, I guarantee you in fact that this will work. Now I've done a lot of work in this video. Trust me. At the end of this video I'm pretty sure you'll be like oh thank god it worked. So yeah let's get started. Okay, so now uh, it's a pretty simple trick. Now I'm gonna teach you how to mirror your uh, iPhone screen to your TV. Now it doesn't have to be smart TV. It doesn't have to be Apple TV. Right now I'm gonna be using a Sony Bravia 4K and 3D TV that I'll be using as a experiment, and I'm pretty sure it will work. Now the phone I'm, I'll be using is the iPhone 6S Plus. That's my actual daily driver right now. Alright, so let's get started. Now before we start, you need actually you actually need a computer or a laptop. Right now I have my own laptop here on your screen, you can see on your screen. Now okay, so on your laptop you have to turn your Wi Fi on and you have to download this software called software called uh a PowerSoft iPhone recorder. Now I'm pretty sure that it doesn't sound pretty good to you, doesn't it? Now it it is because I know it's all right. So it's a pretty simple. It's a sim it's a software not for recording. Trust me, it's not for recording. It's for the TV. Now that software will allow us to fake the Apple TV thing. Now iPhone does not connect to a any any small TV out there. It doesn't have to be Samsung, Sony, or anything. It only connects to the Apple TV. Now this software that I am downloading right now will help us. Uh, connect to a non Apple TV. Now, trust me, this will work. Okay, so it's called you have to search for search a PowerSoft iPhone recorder. Now, click on the first link, and by the way, you don't have to worry about anything. I'll, I will put all the links in the description box below so you don't have to worry about anything. Okay, so it's available for iMac, it's available for Mac and, and Windows. So, I assume that everybody is using Windows, then you have to download for desktop. So click download and it will start the downloading. Now it should take about probably seconds because it's only 30 MBs. It's not much of a big deal, now does it? Okay, so uh, I'm gonna click download. All right, so it's downloading. All right, guys, uh, it's already downloaded. Uh, it's on my desktop. Okay, so all you gotta do is to install the software. It will take about 20 to 30 seconds depending on your computer speed right now. So yeah, mine's mine's taking a bit longer. It should not take that much longer. Okay, so that's it. <laughs> Alright, click yes. Oh, uh, I think I uh, double click it twice. Alright. Okay, so hit next. Yeah, I accept it. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, next. Next. Yeah, desktop would be nice. Yeah, go, okay. Okay, next. Uh, okay, so installation has begun. Should take 10 seconds. Yep, less than 10 seconds actually. Okay, so software is installed. Now, you want to launch it, so yeah, you better check that and uh, click finish to launch the application. Now, it might take a while at the first startup, but it should not take that much. It's just a simple software. Okay, there you go, guys. Now you don't have to buy anything, trust me, you don't have to pay for anything, it's a simple video, it's a free video. Okay, so click evaluate. Okay, now that's that's the screen that we need. Now that's that's the that's the screen we need. Now you don't have to do anything, just uh now uh just keep it as it is. Don't close anything, no do not do nothing. Okay, so now to to move forward now there are two steps now you can use you can actually use an HDMI cable or you can also watch my previous videos to connect your laptop to your TV via wireless wirelessly you know like using a, uh, <coughs> a screen mirroring right now to quickly quick things up I'm using these uh, HDMI cables that I got from the TV from Sony actually so I'm gonna be using these cables. Now, if you do, if you don't have any cable, you can buy it, or you can also my video, also watch my video that I uh, showed 
in in that I showed you how to connect your laptop screen to TV wirelessly. So that's pretty easy too. Okay, so all right, guys. Now it took me some time to connect the connect the laptop to the TV, but it was worth it. And trust me, I mean I enjoyed it. But it, it took a lot of out of me. So you can see the icon on your, on my TV. That that's the HDMI icon. It shows that there is a device available for that, uh, but for that port. All right. So yeah, let's click that, and uh, we should be able to get the display. Now you might not get the display at the first because on your on your desktop on your on your laptop it says that uh, you have selected the screen only your laptop screen only now to change that click uh, Windows and uh, P on your de on your keyboard it will it will pop up this uh, this project screen thing and it will uh, then you have to click the duplicate now you want to replicate your desktop to your TV. So yeah, that's that's the, that's the option we need. Now hit that, and it it will automatically show the screen of your uh, for the de for uh, I will show you your laptop screen on your TV. Now that's a pretty standard procedure for screen mirroring. You can also do the same step using nothing but your Wi-Fi. I have tons of videos on my channel. You can go on and watch those videos if you want to. So yeah, but this time I'm using HDMI cable. Okay, so you can see, you can clearly see that's my TV and it's completely connected. I can I can move cursor and show you that, yeah, it's working. Okay, so yep, that's it's working. It's completely working. Now the st step is to connect your phone. That's pretty pretty simple. Let me just take take my daily driver out. It's iPhone 6s Plus. I told you before. Now let me let me just set a camera for this. Alright guys, I have, uh, okay, so camera and everything is all set up. Now let me just show you, okay, this is my daily driver, as you can see, uh, me on my screen, obviously. I mean, I mean, it's kind of a, <laughs> it's kind of, <laughs> I know it's kind of weird, but that's me. Alright, <coughs> let me just uh, quickly unlock my phone to show you how it works. Okay, I can use fingerprint, but, I, you know. Alright. Uh, this is my uh, this is my actual daily daily driver. It's not a uh, it's a phone to check or anything. Okay, this is an actual iPhone 6s Plus. My daily driver. Okay, so now the thing the, that's pretty pretty simple. Just swipe up the control panel. Okay, so once you swipe up the control panel, you can see the option called AirPlay mirroring. Now it's a pretty pretty standard option for iPhone to connect for connect to Apple TV, but as you can see here, it actually shows my laptop. Now that's the software is doing. Now it actually telling this iPhone that there is an Apple TV currently running on in background. Now this is the kind of thing that we need, all right? That that it show it actually telling the iPhone that there is an a Apple TV right now. Oh, by the way, that's my dad's name because my laptop is registered on my dad's name. So because he bought it, <laughs> yeah. Anyways. Okay, so we want to click on that. Yep, and it will. It should connect to your TV without you without doing anything else. Trust me, it will automatically connect it. Now you can't see it on my TV because I minimized the I option. I minimized the application. Okay, so yeah, that's see. You can clearly see that it's working right now. Okay, let me just uh, full screen the application. All right, guys, you can clearly see that's my iPhone. Oh my God, my dad's calling me. Right, I should um maybe I should cancel it right now. I'll, I should be I'll call him back. Just need to complete this video. All right, you can see the you can clearly see it's working on my TV. All right, so let me just uh let me just set the focus and show you that it's really working. Oh my God, that's those are my pictures. I mean, <laughs> those are <laughs> private pictures actually. <laughs> Uh, okay, so let me just uh, open a dark picture to show you that it's actually working. Yep, that's working. I'm sorry about the bad quality, but it's it is what it is. Anyways, uh, let me just um, set it to wallpaper that so you can actually see that it's uh, it's working. Okay, so that's it. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And I hope you like this video. And I am I am apologizing again and again for my previous video. I know it was a bad thing to do, but I don't know what to, I don't know what to do anymore. But uh, I finally figured it out, and this is the solution. So thank you so much for watching, guys. And I will be uploading these kind of videos in the near future, maybe tomorrow, and uh, maybe day after tomorrow. 
So be sure to subscribe for that. And thank you so much for watching, guys. Peace out.